On July 1, 2024, the Philippine Air Force PAF, celebrated its 77th anniversary, marking almost eight decades of service to the nation. The event was a significant milestone that showcased the evolution of the PAF and its current capabilities. The celebration featured an impressive display of military hardware, including the Spider ground-based air defense system, F-A-50 light combat aircraft, and S-70I Black Hawk helicopters. The demonstration highlighted the PAF's commitment to enhancing its sustainment capabilities and safeguarding national security. The celebration brings us back to the multi-role fighter MRF, acquisition project that the Philippine Air Force is currently pushing. Recent reports indicate that Swedish aircraft manufacturer Saab has increased its bid for the JAS-39 Gripen E variant to rival Lockheed Martin's F-16 Block 7072 Viper bid. Reports from the defense sector indicate that the MRF acquisition project is progressing smoothly, with the budget for the multi-role fighter aircraft expected to be released soon. While specific details regarding budget allocations have yet to be disclosed, it is clear that the MRF acquisition project is a top priority for the Department of National Defense DND, under the revised Horizon 3 phase. The Horizon 3 phase is part of the revised AFP modernization program, which aims to enhance the capabilities of the armed forces of the Philippines through the acquisition of advanced defense equipment and technologies. The program is divided into several phases, with each phase focusing on a different aspect of modernization. The current phase emphasizes the acquisition of multi-role combat aircraft, long-range surveillance systems, and advanced missile systems. The successful acquisition and integration of these multi-role combat aircraft will have significant strategic implications for the Philippines. These advanced aircraft will enhance the PAF's ability to conduct air defense operations, maintain air superiority, and project power throughout the region. They will also provide a credible deterrent to potential threats, thereby contributing to regional stability and security. While progress on the MRF acquisition project is promising, several challenges remain. These challenges include budget constraints, logistical considerations, and the need for extensive training for pilots and maintenance crews. In turn, for the PAF to effectively operate and maintain these advanced aircraft will require continued investment in training and infrastructure. Moreover, in a broader context, the Philippines' defense modernization efforts go beyond the acquisition of multi-role fighter aircraft. The PAF must also focus on enhancing its capabilities in cyber defense, intelligence, surveillance and reconnaissance ISR, and unmanned aerial systems UAS. These capabilities are critical to addressing a range of security challenges, from conventional military threats to non-traditional security issues such as terrorism and natural disasters. The 77th anniversary of the Philippine Air Force marks a significant milestone in its history, reflecting its evolution into a modern and highly capable Air Force. The celebration highlights the PAF's commitment to enhancing its protection capabilities and safeguarding national security. The ongoing modernization efforts, supported by the national government and the House of Representatives, are critical to safeguarding the evolving security environment and ensuring the country's territorial integrity. The multi-role fighter aircraft acquisition project, with candidates such as the JAS-39 Gripen E and the Lockheed Martin F-16 Block 7072 Seconds Viper, is a critical component of the PAF's modernization strategy. The successful acquisition and integration of these advanced aircraft will significantly enhance the PAF's operational capabilities and contribute to regional stability. As the PAF continues its modernization efforts, it must continue to address the challenges and complexities associated with the acquisition and integration of sophisticated maintenance systems. Continued investment in training, infrastructure, and support capabilities will be critical to ensuring that the PAF can effectively operate and maintain its new equipment. The future of the Philippine Air Force looks promising with a clear commitment to modernization and a strategic focus on enhancing its capabilities. As the PAF continues to adapt to the changing security environment, it will play a critical role in maintaining the country's sustainability and contributing to regional peace and stability.